All right, time now for Unusual Activity, the birthday edition. Pete, what are you saying? <laughs> I got an extra one for you today, as a matter of fact, Frank. So we're going to start off with Alcoa. Now, Alcoa is pretty interesting because then it has a great results from 2021. This is a stock that was $25. It's run all the way up to about $60. As a matter of fact, today, trading right around $58.20, we had a monstrous buyer of 10,000 of the January 7th expiring 60 calls. So they bought those. They paid about $2.50, call it, for those options. That was interesting because they're rolling it up from the 58 calls that have already performed for them. They're taking that off, and they're going into the 60s. I got a second one for you, which is Microsoft. Microsoft seems to hit almost every couple of days, and it hit today. Stock was trading between 326, 329. I now look, just took a, a moment to look at it. It's trading a little over 330, but we saw some huge buying, but these expire tomorrow, Frank, so this is a very, very quick expiration cycle for these. December 23rd, that's tomorrow. They bought 13,000 of the 330 calls. They were only going for a little over a dollar, a dollar up to about a dollar 50 for those calls. The last one I've got for you is Carnival Cruise. Now this one has already hit three times in December. The first time they were buying this week's expiring 19 calls. Then they were expiring the 20 calls were the next buyer. Today, they're actually going out in time a little bit. They're going all the way out to April and they bought 9,800 of the April 20 25 calls in CCL as it's trading right around $21 a share. So that that those options were a buck 35. What made that interesting is this is a very smart trade. I think they're selling the upside calls against that. Once again, limiting the upside, not saying it's going through 30, but buying those 25s and buying a little bit of time. Pretty interesting to see all three of these. And like I said earlier, it's interesting to see both the airlines and you see the cruise ships, you're also seeing hotels, all these reopens. We're seeing more and more and more of it on the unusual.